Welcome to uh, Not So Deep Thoughts Remastered. That's what we'll call it. Yeah. It's been a long time since I've been in front of a camera. It has been, yeah. <laughs> it shows. You uh, You look like you've become uh, <laughs> a model for Abercrombie and Fitch since then. This? Yeah. This shirt is old. What do you add? Uh, an extra for Ellen in case she has a stunt double? I don't dress like Ellen anymore. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do, uh, J-Rock, uh, the game rocker, does weekly blogs, vlogs, called Between a Rock and a Hard Place. They're awesome. Check them out. Um, and it's a good way to... Keep content fresh and keep content happening on your channel and still interacting with the community when you don't actually have a lot of time to do anything else. We should name this The World Revolves Around the Chronicles of a Rock in a Hard Place. It's a good idea. <laughs> I like that. Just thought of it. Just that just came to you? Yeah, it's pretty good. I don't know where it came from. <laughs> um, yeah, I like that. I think that's what we'll call it. I have been jealous of all three of their channels, though. Because they, they, they all kind of do sit this. and gab, yeah. yeah. So we're going to try and do that every week. So we're going to come up with a topic. We're going to give ourselves 10 minutes on the dot. Um, so this one will be a little longer, obviously, because the explanation in the beginning. Oh. Um, so 10-minute we'll videos, we'll get a little topic, and then we'll talk about what we've been up to that week. Um, so any weeks where the topic is really good, you won't find out what we've been up to. And any weeks where the topic is weaker, you'll find out what we've been up to. Good call. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to set my handy-dandy iPhone 5C. Who gave you that idea? Timer? I don't know. To 10 minutes. He actually abandoned that. I've noticed it getting longer than 10 minutes, oh. so I stopped watching him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I watch your videos, J-Rock, till 10 minutes, and then I turn them off. I never know what happens in those last few minutes. <laughs> Usually he plays with his animals. <laughs> All right, so here we go. So today's... Actually, you know what we're going to do? Here's what we're going to do. Okay. 10 minutes from the time we say the topic. No, no, it's two 10 minutes now. We're not going to fill 10 minutes. Okay, you're right. Here we go. <laughs> So, the topic uh, for this episode of Not Too Deep Thoughts, that's mm. also hashtag NSDT. Ooh. Trending. Um, is it? No, that might be. Who knows? Um, is uh, what game, what currently unannounced games do you hope to see at E3? So I can't say Last Guardian or Star Fox, that kind of thing? No, because those are games that we have already been announced. Oh, God. Um, although Last Guardian, I guess you could almost, it's been so long now since we've read anything, it's almost become it's unannounced. unannounced. Yeah. yeah, it's like a born again virgin. It's, uh, <laughs> ah, you know what, I haven't had sex for a week and a half because uh, I haven't been drunk, so I'm a born again virgin. Um, wow. So, what unannounced game do you want to see at E3? So, uh, you want to go first? So, like I said, yeah. I have a couple, maybe you should go first. Alright, so it's not, none of the games that we already know, no Star Fox, no Link. No Last Guardian. We know we're going to see those games. We know we're going to see stuff like that. Mm. Um, so what do I want to see? What current unannounced game do I want to see? There's actually three on my list. Oh, all right. Yeah. Number one, and uh, probably the biggest one, mm -hmm. which I, I don't know if you can even call it unannounced because I feel like it's going to happen anyway, okay. is a an HD addition to the Metroid franchise. Mm -hmm. I want to see, but not just like an HD, I don't want to see Metroid Prime 4. I want to see Nintendo go back to like a traditional... Side scroller, two and a half D Metroid game in HD. It's like a on, retro on the game, yeah. Kind of take on it. Exactly, yeah. Taking it and like imagine having that map right there in the game pad so you can check it. Mm. Maybe give me the ability to mark where items are that would be with the stylus cool. or things you have to come back to. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's what I, that's the number one on my list that I really really hope we see. Um, so That'd be awesome. That's yeah, the first. What about you? What's your number one? What number? What's the big one that you really hope they show? Oh, jeez, I kind of want that one now. <laughs> um, I wouldn't mind seeing an F-Zero. Yeah? Oh. Yeah. HD F-Zero would be pretty cool. I mean, we got Mario Kart, which is awesome, but I'd like to see a really fast... You uh, want to go HD, fast. Yeah. What about Sonic uh, Racing Transformed All-Star? I've never played any of them. I know. Uh, I heard they're good. Yeah. Anzi uh, speaks quite highly of them. Uh, most people do. Yeah. So an F-Zero. Hmm. Want to see Captain Falcon in HD. Yeah. Taking it. Yeah. All right. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. I don't we're going to see it, but what can you do? Mm -hmm. You never know. I mean, they could surprise us, right? They need something else to come up. I mean, Mario Kart, we had a big one there, so... Yeah, my other one was Metroid, so... Uh, what else do you got? Well, um, so other than Metroid, which I am really, uh, really would like to see, mm -hmm. uh, my second one, this is my long... This is my medium shot. So the first one was a, I think we're going to see a Metroid title. Mm -hmm. This one is a medium shot. It's a maybe... But probably unlikely, and that is 
uh, a new Mega Man game. Mm. Nintendo took Mega Man and put through in Smash Bros. And anybody who's played Smash Bros. knows the Blue Bomber looks so good in HD on that game. Yeah. He looks so good. So to sort of uh, battle up against Mighty Number no. Nine, if they were to release a, like a traditional Mega Man, back to the and not the X series, but like Mega Man. Mm. Um, I would like seeing the X game too, though. Yeah. All right. But uh, I don't take either, to be honest. I think Nintendo, if, if Capcom said, you know what, Nintendo, take them, just throw a name on the box, do what you want to do with them, I think that would be a, mm, that would be a big boost. Once again, Metro Studios could probably do really good with that. You could swap your weapons right from the gamepad if you wanted to. Or Ooh, yeah. I like how you're thinking. Yeah. So what would you, you get another one? I stole your Metroid? Uh, I wouldn't mind seeing another turn-based RPG. Yeah? Just in general. Anyone at all? Just anything other than Persona. Yeah? <laughs> Something more traditional-like? Yeah, I mean, like, uh, I mean, obviously they're not going to do Final Fantasy now. That's very different now. But what about like a uh, Super Mario RPG two? You know yeah, I mean? or uh, yeah. that'd be pretty cool. Something along those lines. Yeah, I mean, be a, a new Lufia. I'm looking forward to playing Lost Odyssey. Uh, I haven't played it yet, but that kind of game in HD, I think, would be fantastic. Hmm. Cool. It's a dying genre, man. It really is. You don't see a lot of turn-based RPGs now. Yeah, yeah RPGs, the ones you do uh, see are not good. Well, they're hand, like a lot of handheld exclusive ones, and it's nice. That's to, fun too. You're not you're not much of a handheld gamer, but I yeah, I'd rather it be on the console, but yeah. And uh, okay, so my third, my very last one. This is my long shot. You know, I'm calling it deep. Not a chance in hell are we getting this. You're not gonna see Mega Man. <laughs> no, uh, maybe not. <laughs> but I want to see. Um, Kojima, holy shit. Oh, I'll talk about that. <laughs> I want to see Kojima walk on stage, and I want to see him go, uh, I left Konami, we're no longer together, and now I'm doing Castlevania Symphony of the Night 2, and it's going to be exclusive on, and I don't give a fuck. Whatever system he wants to put it on. But he left Konami. How can he do it? He could do it on his own, Kojima Studios. Yeah, man, they don't own Castlevania. Doesn't, well, he built it, didn't he? he... No. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> he does everything for fucking Konami. Um, he's Metal Gear Solid. Really? He, yeah. he had nothing to do with Castlevania? No, I think it was Sakurai that did the uh, Oh, well, Castlevania. Jesus, I'm like an idiot. He left too, though, so don't we worry. We can't edit this at all now. People are going to see that I'm stupid. I might be wrong! <laughs> <laughs> you tell us, who invented Castlevania? <laughs> he was Kojima. No? <laughs> all right. He's crazy, Maybe he was, maybe what? I bet you he wrote number two, because that story doesn't make any fucking Oof. sense. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, so you have a third one, like a long shot? Well, Beautiful Joe 3? I wouldn't mind seeing Castlevania, though. I think that'd be yeah. awesome. Uh, one that isn't like this new Lords of Shadow. You don't want, you don't want to see whatever. God of War Castle being God of yeah. War, God of War being yet. Yeah, no, I'd like to see a real one. Oh, uh, what else would I like to see? I don't know. That's it. All right, that's it. You're not gonna be excited. You want to keep it up? Well, we got uh, three. We got four minutes left. Holy. Let's talk about what we're doing. All right. So you know, man, what are you doing? I've been. Uh, not much working. Yeah, doing some renovations around the house. What uh, uh, what's going on? I know you put up those new shelves in the kitchen. Yeah. I came over and helped you with that. Yeah, nice. we did our cabinets and everything. Anyway, they care. They don't care. <laughs> they don't care. Uh, got yeah. a big piece of art in the dining room now. Oh, what'd you get? It's like a New York. Anyway, I've been watching The Wire. That's, Ooh. that's something media related. Somebody told me The Wire was the highest rated television show of all time. Who told like, you that? Or maybe drama. Is that true? I don't know. It's what he told, told me. That was a guy at work. He's, I mean, he's fairly smart. His Father's got like four degrees. His mother's a rocket, an actual fucking rocket scientist. Wow. Yeah, he's got his brother and sister are both engineers. I don't know why he's in the fucking navy. Confirmed then. Yeah. Yeah. So, I, I mean, don't know. It's good. Yeah. Seasons one to f to three, really good. I'm terrified of putting on season four because season the way season three ended, I feel like that was that's it. We're shutting the show down. You know? seen Breaking Bad. Yep. Season four in Breaking Bad is very similar to season four in The Wire. Oh, okay. It's kind of draggy. It's kind of. It's the. They should have ended it. Yeah, we're, not, <laughs> we're keep. We're still going because we're making lots of money. Yeah. Next year we're gonna wrap it up. That's what I'm hoping because I'm in season five right now. Yeah, well, season five is the last one. I just don't. Did it get canceled or did it actually end? I don't know. I don't know. I think it ended. I'll let you know. Well, if it's the highest rated drama of all time, <laughs> I can't imagine it just got axed. <laughs> yeah, true. You know. Yeah. The way season four ended was actually really good. The very last episode. Yeah. I mean, people they don't want to hear about it. They might. The, check the wire. Check it out. Uh what have we been playing? Uh, game of the month. Game which of the month. Recorded on Saturday. Beautiful Joe. Yeah. Awesome game. Uh, Rambox, thank you so much. Did he make it? No, but he was. He been trying to get us to play oh, for no, months. <laughs> Could have been part of. What was it? Clover that did it. Clover. Yeah. Yeah. Who then became platinum? Who is now my favorite developer? Yeah. 
Yeah. yeah. Thank you for the Rare Box because we probably never would have played that. And now the Platinum is like almost a strictly Nintendo. We might get another beautiful gel. Boom. You that know? should have been your E3 pick right there. That should have been. But I'm going to talk about that in the podcast. Mm. Yeah. I, uh, I've been playing that. I've been playing a lot of Steam. Our codename Steam. Which is really good. You can play that? I didn't know that. Yeah. It's a lot of fun. The periods where you're waiting for the enemies are really kind of long. Mm. Um, but that's okay because I play it while I'm watching TV with uh, the missus. So mm -hmm. I can sort of zone in and out. But I'm really enjoying it. I think it uh, it could end up being a good uh, franchise for them if they keep it running. Mm. I bought a giant Amiibo case. This thing is awesome, man. Yeah. It lights up. I, have, I guess they can see it. Okay. Yeah. I've got every uh, every Amiibo they've released. Uh, you got to plug it in. I'm terrified it'll blow these lights. Okay. So you don't get to see it lit up, folks. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. What do you think of this? You think this is gonna work? Ah, well, I don't know. We'll put it up there. If they watch it, they watch it. <laughs> they don't, they don't. <laughs> All right. You know. Hopefully, we'll have more stuff to talk about next time. Maybe. Or we'll just get better topics. Maybe. But that's what we want to see. So I want to know what games you want to see. Oh. You know? So we, you know, we said Metroid. We said uh, Mega Man. We said, uh, what did you say? F-Zero. F-Zero. Yeah, so we played it pretty safe. Except for that, uh, except for Kojima's take on Castlevania. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that one. <laughs> That's my biggest here. hope. Yeah. Turns out that Simon Belmont is actually Dracula. And wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, no, that's what they did. Yeah, the shot. yeah. that sounds familiar. Uh, yeah. We'll move on. We'll yeah. move on. Anyway, we should really look up who... Tre Trevor Belmont is a cyborg <laughs> sent from the future. <laughs> hey, have you played Revengeance? I heard it's really good. Um, not yet, but I have it. Oh, you have it? Yeah, it's a platinum game, so I bought it. Ah, oh, you jerk. We still got time, dude. You're you're sitting down, and we still have How 23 I... seconds. All right, hold on. I'll look up the You're going to look up this Castlevania thing in 23 seconds? Yeah. i got to just entertain people for 23 seconds? You can do it. All right. Yeah. So we had uh, rats in our basement. Koji. That was terrible. Oh, yeah. How's that going? Uh, we filled the hole with cement. Nine bag. I had to hold my basement oh, so shit. big. It took nine bags of gravel and uh, three bags of cement. Are you gonna both tell me Kojima did Castlevania? Because no. I will fucking end the video. No, he might have done like Lords of Shadow, but he definitely didn't do the original. Uh, all right, well we're done. All right, folks, just ten minutes. Tell us what games you want to see. Tell us if this worked. Um, we have got to edit out that whole thing. I think. <laughs>